Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. caller who thinks we're better off thanks to Spike. Let's see if I can set her straight. You're on with J. Jonah Chase. I just want to say that I've never seen Manhattan so safe and peaceful. Compare what it was like when Spider-Man first showed up to now. Okay, fair enough, I will. Then, we had police and firefighters doing a wonderful job. There was crime, sure, but nothing they couldn't handle. Of course, we do have things now we didn't have then. Maniacs who shoot electricity out of their eyes. Walking piles of sand? Nazis made of bees? Didn't Spider-Man put all those guys in jail? You're missing the point! They didn't exist before- Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets that angle, my life's over. need to get it straight on. Give me the plans and it won't. Very nice. Gotcha. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak the photo.
plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the highline. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the other side of the highline. Gotta follow him. Where is he getting off? Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of hiking movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. Practically a kid. 
my brother's kid. We can't trust him. Anyway, it's done. He's already picking up our secrets. All right. Roman's ready and we are running late. Let's roll. They're on the move. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. I love it when a plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jensen. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention. Oh, my God. 
going viral. Hey, look at me! Don't trust those other guys. I'm Spider-Man. Wait, am I Spider-Man? And this is why we do not clone. No clones! That's it, huh? I've had worse commutes. Get out of here, Spider-Man. We'll handle it now. Beautiful. Possible drug deal in progress. Nearest unit approach with caution. Officers needed on scene in Clinton. Drug deals and criminals. They go together like cookies and milk. Yeah, man. All proceeds are going to the Wilson Fisk Legal Defense Fund. Not good. You guys sent the fuckers on vacation. Gotta be honest. Not a fan of Big Pharma, especially back alley Big Pharma. <laughs> Knocking the ever-loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti-drug. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. I could really use a muffin. A blueberry muffin. If I had powers, I wouldn't fight crime, I'll tell you that. I'd be a TV star. Uh, I'd be a pro wrestler. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm uh, sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane, she's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. 
Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place. Peter, Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter.
good, Spidey. Don't worry about it. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget, I just, I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker, you're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? Peace. All units, narcotic sale reported in progress. Officers needed near Civic Center. Drug deals and criminals. They go together like cookies and milk. Gotta be honest, not a fan of Big Pharma, especially back alley Big Pharma. Drugs are maybe my most disliked criminal activity. Definitely top five. Or bottom five, if however that works. Did I hurt you guys? Good news! Spider-Man! I need a minute! Look, I know you've been hacking into our crime system towers. Wasn't me. I mean, what towers? I don't mind. In fact, I need your help. I think someone's jamming the system, and they must be using multiple jammers to cover the full frequency range. Could you take a look? If you help, I promise I won't tell anyone you're hacking us. I prefer to call it sharing, but sure. The jammers emit a signal I can detect. Just need to swing through the financial district and hunt for a signal. Found a signal. Just need to follow it. I'll check the taller rooftops in the district. The closer I am to the jammer, the stronger the signal gets. Fisk's man. This Get is my shock face. I'll teach you some respect. Yeah! 
Shut your mouth. Just need to get rid of the jammer. Can't forget to wreck the jammer. Sometimes breaking stuff is the answer. And it's fun too. I just took out a jamming device. Did that do anything? No, but like I said, there's probably a bunch of them. Makes sense. I'll track them down. I wonder if Fist's men had anything to do with the system going down in the first place. Jamming to... I'm gonna guess these guys aren't here to tan. What's the matter? Sleep it off. Gotta take out the jamming device. Shoddy workmanship. Spider-Man, it's working. I'm starting to get a weak signal. It's garbled, but I picked up something about Fisk and Outfit. Fisk was the kingpin of crime, but he didn't deal in knockoff fashion. The sooner the system is fixed, the sooner we know what they're planning. Only one jammer left. Why we need these jammers? Found you. Literally didn't see that coming. Someone should react to me. Now I just need to wreck the jammer. Okay, that's the last of them. The system should be back online. Spider-Man, the crime system's working again. Great. Any more info on Fist's men or those outfits? No, but the system's reporting unauthorized activity down by the dock. I'm sending coordinates now. I'll check it out. Gotta get to the docks before they escape. Nailed it. Enough firepower for a small army. Whatever they're planning to do with those, it's nothing good. Gotta find out what those guns are for. Song. 
someone's in sweet dreams. Safety's off. Anybody hear that? Lady Knight. Could have been pigeons. Who's there? <laughs> Spread out! Now maybe I can figure out what's going on. Prison guard uniforms and spoofed ID cards. They were planning to bust Fisk out of the raft. Sorry to spoil your prison break, guys. Looks like New York's finest have it from here. Everything's clear on my end, too. Thanks for restoring the system, Spider-Man. I won't tell anyone you're piggybacking on it, but if you get caught, you're on your own. I have no idea what you're talking about. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to delete my selfies from the crime system servers. why Jonah paid me the big bucks. myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, 
speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Attention units, a break-in was just reported. Location is south of Houston. Look like locksmith. So, you're all going to jail. Where I bet you'll be as good at breaking out as you were at breaking in. Crime would decline post-fisk. Might have been too optimistic. 